Witnesses say he had a cold, calculated plot to kill. Brand new revelations in court against a man charged with gunning down a Detroit mother as her children looked on. We'll start there at 5.30. Chilling new details coming to light today in the murder of Latrice Morris Dorsey. Dorsey was killed back on June 18th inside her Detroit home. Her ex-boyfriend, Earl Maxwell, faces first-degree murder charges in the case. Jason Colthorpe is following the story for us tonight, and Jason, he is headed to trial. Yes, he is, Karen, and some of those awful details, we knew that she was murdered with her four-year-old daughter in the same room, her 14-year-old son in the next room. But today, the autopsy report discussed and introduced, and it was learned this woman was shot 10 times. Latrice Morris Dorsey had dated Earl Maxwell for about four years until right before she was murdered. Testimony today at Maxwell's preliminary hearing indicated they'd broken up and she was dating someone else, and clearly Maxwell was upset. Her estranged husband testified about a few phone calls with Maxwell. What did he say the first time you spoke? When I see your wife, I'm going to kill her. The second time he called, he reiterated that he was going to hurt her. That was two weeks before the murder on Avon. Maxwell's defense attorney, though, challenged Dorsey's testimony, saying it conflicted with his statement to police. Well, no, sir. What did I just say? I said, first time I said he called back, he said he killed her. He called back five minutes later, told me he, was go he, he wasn't going to kill her. But that's what he said. He said twice he was going to kill her. Okay, but that's not what's in your statement, is it? Yeah, that's because that's because let me tell you why that's because no, my no, wife no, that's because my wife was dead and I'm you. going through my mind crazy. Okay, okay? I, and you guys cost me and question me. Question. Now, I know I know. Go ahead. Do your let's thing. do this. Do but the prosecutor pointed to another statement. Max Wells in his statement claims that he accidentally shot Ms. Dorsey 10 times. He specifically indicates that he accidentally shot her in the back of the head um, in her in her hands, um, throughout her body. All with that four-year-old girl in the room. And what you heard there, a word, accidentally, is what the defense is focusing on to try and get this first-degree part of the murder charge. That seems to be the sticking point here, uh, including uh, one of those shots that went to the back of the head, they saying was accidental in kind of this, this whole flurry of things. But again, he was bound over on the first-degree murder charge as well. Back to you, Karen. Jason, talk to me about the defense. Are they trying this as a crime of passion because Maxwell allegedly fled the scene? He did fl flee the scene, yes, and uh, police also say he tossed the weapon. So both of those conflict with a crime of passion sort of thing. And as you also heard, that uh, conversation, those threats made in testimony today happened two weeks before this killing. Both, all of those, the prosecution points to this was premeditated. Very disturbing. All right. Thank you, Jason. Very.